welcome to engineers house channel today we are going to discuss about the Fourier series and its applications and show you a code that generates its three coefficients well we know that in mechanical engineering if you want to find the time response of a system to a non-harmonic force we'd better transfer the original force function into its summation of sines and cosines functions and then solve the related differential equation with respect to this summation in this case we have considered a periodic function consisting of two different inner functions. As you see, first function is exponential of x and the other one is x, which is a linear function. There is also their defined domain in front of each of them. Well, let's move to the code. Run the code as usual and enter the number of terms that your function has. In this case, we have two inner functions, so I'm going to enter two. Now, we should specify the preciseness that we want. It basically means that how many of sines and cosines should be summed together in order to generate the Fourier series of the original function. To make it simpler for the computer, let's only have 10 of them. In this part, we should enter the function formula. Well, the first formula was the exponential of x, the second one was x. Now, we enter the domain of each regulation with the starting point at the beginning. The exponential function starts at 0, finishes at 1, the linear function starts at 1, and ends at 2. Finally, we let the computer know how many of the series we want, and again, we'd better pick a small number. I'm gonna enter 1. Well, as you may see, we have the three coefficients that we were looking for, and there is a summation of sines and cosines at the last line. There is also a figure which shows the function at one periodic step, the Fourier series itself, and the function and the Fourier series simultaneously. Thanks for watching this video. Let us know any questions you have, and do not forget to like and subscribe.